What's going on guys, Quick Shift here. Here we are at the final week of card announcements for Forza Horizon 2. It's been a, it's been a long journey. <laughs> uh, the final review actually gives us a total of 210 cards, which is awesome. Uh, they just kind of gave us the rest of the cards, which is sick. And sorry for a later upload today, I was stuck doing a Parachute Canada thing, or a review thing for my co-op class. So that's why it took a little longer. I have to try and get 100% on each section. There was like six different parts I had to do, so it took a while. But um, I'm done, so let's hop right into this list and do this stuff, I guess. I don't know. Uh, first off, we have the 1968 Lancia Fulvia Coupe Rally 1.6 H, 1.6 HF. So it's a pretty cool car. Not a big fan of the body style, but it's just nice. It's, it's a cool small car, I guess. I don't know if you're into that kind of stuff. Big headlights and stuff like that. Uh, next up, we have the 1993 Renault Clio Williams. This is a sick little front-wheel drive. I think it's front-wheel drive. Um hatchback it's small it just it, it suits the area and which is actually really cool i've never actually heard of this car until now and that's one thing i really like about the forza series is that i get to find new cars that i've never heard about before um, and i hope that they keep bringing new cars into the game which would be really cool um Next up, we have the 1997 Land Rover Defender 90. So once again, we got ourselves another off-road vehicle. This time, it's an SUV, and it's a Land Rover. So you know it's legit. It's a really sick car. Um, hopefully, we'll get some good customization options like roof racks, maybe some uh, like brush guards, uh, fog lights, stuff like that. That'd actually be really cool. Um, and obviously, lifts and stuff like that for your truck. Uh, next up, nine or 2000. I always want to say 19 something. Uh, t next up, we have the 2015 Ford Mustang GT. So I'm pretty sure everyone knows what this is or what it looks like. Um, we got it as free DLC in Forza 5. A beautiful car. Um, nice to have in the Horizon 2 series. Uh, next up, 1984 Honda. I wanted to say Honda. Honda Civic CRX Mugen. So we had this in uh, Forza 5 as well. Nice little putt putt. I'm just joking. I was hoping we get a CRX. I was hoping for the regular, uh, like 92 model, but it's nice to have a CRX back in the game. Um, next up, we have the 2003 Ferrari Challenge Straddle, or I call it the 360 Spider. Beautiful car. I've been a fan of the car since I was a kid. So it's nice to have this in the Horizon 2 series. I think we had in for Forza Horizon 1 as well. I don't know. I'm my my memory's kind of rusty. Um, uh, 1970 Chevrolet Cor Corvette ZR1. I'm not. I don't know. It's nice to have this back in the game. Um, I'm not a big fan of the Corvettes. They're nice cars. Just I'd like to stick with cars I'd never got to drive or anything like that. Um, next up, we have the 1987 Ferrari F40. I was talking about the F30 or F50 being in the game, and I was kind of like, I don't know. I don't really like the F50 body style. I like the F40, so it's nice to have the the F40 in the game. I do like the squared off body style more than like the round one, so it's cool to have this back in the game. Uh, next up, we have the 19 we have the 1966 Ford GT40 MK2. I googled the image, or I ended up googling all the images. I don't remember what this car looks like though, and I think a few other cars I don't remember what they look like, so um, I'm not gonna say too much about them. Um, Next up, the 2004 Maserati MC12. I think we had this in Horizon 1 as well. Really, really long car. It's like a boat almost. But really cool car. Um, next up, 1987 Buick, Buick Regal uh, GNX. Another nice car. Uh, 1960 Chevrolet Corvette. 2009 Lotus 211. So that really cheap car that we see a lot in Tag and Forza 5. That small little car that has really good handling. And the horsepower is just right. <laughs> Uh, 1977 Pontiac Firebird Trans Am, a nice car, nice to see more muscle in the game. Uh, 2012 Lamborghini Aventador LP 704, another nice car. 1987 Rough CTR Yellowbird, Yellowbird, so I think we'll be seeing a lot of wheelie tunes coming back in the game, uh, which to me that's what the Rough, that's what the Yellowbird bird's really known for in Forza 5 and games like that. Um, 1956 Ford F100. So we got this, I think, as like a like a gift from like the Thousand Club in in Horizon One, I think. Um, so it's really cool to have this back in the game. I don't know why. I just like slamming mine and uh, putting some nice rims on it, some nice chrome rims. But uh, you, you know, you know, um, <laughs> can't talk. Uh, next up, we have the 2012 Cadillac Escalade ESV. So this was DLC in um in Forza Horizon 1 and I've always wanted to use it for for uh, rally racing in Horizon 1 so I'll be able to use it in Horizon 2 which is, which is really cool so uh, looking forward to that uh 2013 Ford Shelby GT500 another nice muscle car 
1968 Abarth 595 SCs. Um, we had this in Horizon 1 as well. It's that really, it's that, it's that, it's that, I think it was the smallest car in the game, um, and people would use it to get out of the boundaries in uh, some infected maps, which I actually remember that, which is surprising. Um, 2003 Ford Focus RS, another, so we got ourselves a Ford, Ford Focus, Jesus, I have to learn to keep it slow. Um, another nice car, I've been a big fan of the Focus series for a long time, so it's nice to have the 03 in the game. Uh, 2013 Lamborghini Veneno, so we got ourselves the Veneno, it's not DLC, which is amazing because I've always wanted to drive it, I just didn't bother buying it, um, so it's nice to have in Horizon 2, definitely a really cool car to be driving around in uh, Paris and Italy, or yeah, Paris and it, France and Italy, I think, I forget, um, really cool car though, really sick body design, something I've never actually seen before, and it's really different, really futuristic looking car. Um, but yeah, that's that's really it for the for the list. Like I said, they ended up just kind of launching the rest of the cars at us, which they ended up saying in forms or something like that. So uh, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, make sure to subscribe for more content like this video if you did enjoy it, and comment telling me what you guys think of the last cars. Personally, I'm really I'm really liking how they added the Lamborghini and the Land Rover, and especially the F42 because I was hoping that they'd add it. Um, but yeah, that's it, guys. Take her easy. Peace.